بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم اینڈ ویلکم ٹو مائی یوٹیوب چینل ایز یو نو گائز وی آر لرننگ گرافکس ان سی پلس پلس ان آور لاسٹ لیکچر وی ہیو لرنڈ ہاؤ وی کین میک اے ڈیجیٹل کلاک یوزنگ گرافکس ان سی پلس پلس لیٹ می شو یو فسٹ دس از ڈیجیٹل کلاک اینڈ اٹ از شوئنگ آر ریئل ٹائم رائٹ سو دس از ٹائم آن ایگزیکٹلی ایز آن مائی مشین ایز یو کین سی اٹ از ٹین فورٹی فائیو رائٹ ناؤ ان ٹو ڈیز لیکچر وی آر گوئنگ ٹو لرن انادر شیپ وچ از ویری یوزفل اینڈ اٹ از آلسو بلٹ ان ان گرافکس ہیڈر فائل سو ایکچولی اٹ از اے پائس لائف سو وی یوز اٹ ان آر پائے چارٹ وین ایور وی وانٹ ٹو ڈسپلے دا پائے چارٹ وی ول یوز دس شیپ اٹ از کالڈ پائے سلائس سو لیٹ اس ڈائیو ان ٹو دا کوڈ فسٹ آف آل لیٹ می سیٹ دا کلر اینڈ کلر ول بی وائٹ اینڈ دین ایز یو ویل اوور سینٹر پوائنٹ گیٹ میکس x divided by 2 and same int y and get max y divided by 2 so here we get our center point of the screen for pi slice uh, actually we want to fill the pi and fill the slice of that pi chart with some different types of patterns right so we will use set fill style and the pattern will be line fill right and its color will be light so it will be light blue right and then we will draw the pie slice so we will just call the function pie slice and then it takes five parameters right first its location uh, first and second are its location along with x axis and y axis third will be its starting angle fourth will be ending angle and fifth will be its radius so we have already defined its location in the center of the screen and its start angle we will start it from zero and take it up to 75 degree of the angle you have to uh, return in radians angle in radians in this function right and the radius will be mm, let me say 150 right so this is our slice and it will be filled with mm, lines and the color of the lines will be light blue right so let me compile and run it first so you can see it how it is working so this is our pi slice right so for next slice we actually want to uh, draw a proper pi chart so the next will be um, we will actually change the pattern so we can recognize them easily and uh, its pattern will be um, you can say slash fill and its color will be light green right and its slice will be um, we will start it from 75 from where we end this first our uh, our first slice of our pie chart and we will take it to 225 right and then we want one more slice so we can see the whole circle or you can say the full chart so it will be um, pattern will be um, wide dot fill and its color will be so we are giving it red color right and it will begin from 225 to 360 it will complete our circle now it will show us our full pie chart 
<coughs> so as you can see this is our full pie chart right if you want to display a pie chart or you have given a program to write write a pie chart in c++ you can use this function pie slice and make your cell curve make your pie chart let us do some interesting things with this pie chart right so first of all here let's say we want to display our result with our pie chart so i will set text style and its font will be sans serif font and its direction will be horizontal direction and its font will be one right so we want to display you know, the percentage over of subjects according to these um, pie chart right so uh, let me here actually we will also animate this picture no we will also animate this pie chart so we will take infinite loop right first of all we will show our pie chart right then what will we do we will give it delay of 1 second and then clear device to clear the screen and then we will again show our percentages on this pie chart right so first of all our let me write it over here right and this will be out text x y and its position should be 1 x plus 140 and y should be y minus 10 so we can display it um, y minus 110 so we can display it at its proper location and then <coughs> a character pointer array Sorry. And here we will write. To, let's suppose English. We are going to display English percentage over here. It is twenty point eight three. Actually, what we want to do, if you take percentage of seventy five out of three sixty, it would be likely twenty point eight three or twenty one, right? So on our first iteration. it will show this percentage on our this pie slice right and we want also to animate this pie slice right for our english subject so we have to change the coordinates of this x and y so we will make it x plus 10 so it will look like little bit away from the circle and y minus 10 right after that uh, again you have to copy the whole thing and paste it under it and then we will display the next mark so which will be um, you can say over here and they will be x minus 260 actually i have already calculated these value that's why i am writing it here and y minus 100 right and here we have to write it math subject right and its percentage will be 41.67 right and sorry 
we have to delete these values so it will not animate in our next screen and we want to animate this one this one so we can see the math percentage against this slice right so we will do this x minus 10 and then nothing else will be changed so for third slice you have to copy it again and then paste it under and then for third slice cut it from here and write it over here so for third slice its values will be so this one is for you can see signs and its percentage will be about 37 point something I think so right and its values will be here you can delete these values and here x plus 130 and y plus sorry it will I think 110 and this will be plus 130 and for animation of third slice we have to increase the value of y and x will remain same so this was all for the animation purpose mm, now one thing more after whole of this we want to see our full results right so here you can paste it over here copy this one and paste it over here copy this one and paste it over so after loop we want to show our full pie chart with these values with these percentages let compile and run it and see the result so this is our first and it is animating yes and then lastly so loop is going on because loop is infinite that's why it is not showing our, us the full results as you can see in the slice which is animating and we are showing corresponding uh, percentages of the marks against these slices right so it's looking beautiful and uh, now let me make this loop for Mm, two to three times right so int i is equal to zero i less than three so it will animate three time and after that we will show our full results now first english math science english math science english math and science and this is our full result right so it's looking beautiful and also we are moving toward the animation part of our uh, this uh, graphic tutorials this was the code for this i hope you understand and you learn how you can draw a pie chart in this video so until next video don't forget to subscribe my channel also like and share these videos with your friends who are also students and want to learn graphics allah fizz